I did <laughs> mine. What the? <laughs> the burp just slipped out. Live and direct from Hollywood. We are here at BuzzFeed headquarters about to go on the ultimate nacho cheese adventure. We're gonna start off at one nacho place. Then we're gonna ask the people who work there if they want to eat at their own place, where would they get nachos? And so on and so on and so on until we get to the best nacho joint in LA. And everyone's gonna have diarrhea at the end of the day. We've got our, our five categories, the crunch, the toppings, the looks, the cheese, and the drunk factor. How good would these nachos be when you've had a few too many? And we're doing this whole tour in my nacho wagon. He did not paint his truck for this video. His truck is always looking that stupid. There's no air conditioning, so just uh, You're kidding me, Colin. nachos. <laughs> so we're heading to Buffalo Wild Wings. This is Ryan here's favorite nacho spot. It's just my favorite spot. I want one of these. Yeah, all one. Do you guys accept vertical IDs? Oh my god. You don't need to card him, let's be honest. Come on, look at his face. You can cheers that water, oh, Steven. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. Can I say that this looks like very clean nacho? I mean, it looks super clean, yeah. This looks like the LA nacho. Fire. A fire. The queso is fresh. Everything's super fresh. They break really easy, which we all know in nachos when your chips break, that's the biggest bummer. I'm giving crunch. Or seven. Ten. You, ten? Yeah. Holy sh you love these chips. Look at these chunks of chicken. They're huge. Those are. I can appreciate that. Do they so. even have guac in here? There's no guac or <laughs> sour cream. I thought they did. This is how much I remember of my buffalo trips. Yeah, I'm gonna go five on the top because there's no guac, no sour cream, it's huge. You're harsh, Ryan. This is your spot. Drunk factor. I don't want healthy ass nachos when I'm drunk. I'm going four. On the plus side though, if you eat healthy ass nachos when you're drunk, the dads won't be that bad tomorrow. Dad? I am slightly like those. Stay after drinking oh. I'm giving it a seven. Wait, have you ever been drunk before? I've never been drunk before. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. This is a speculative box. I'm putting yeah. a cloud on no, it. No, 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 no. I get a real I get a real rating. Yeah. Put quotes around his number. <laughs> yeah. Six out of ten. Got 139 out of 200. That's like a C, right? One I would know because I dropped out of three colleges and I always got C. Well, I love our nachos. Our nachos are pretty amazing. Um, if not, I would maybe say Big Wangs. There's one in North Hollywood. I'm mediocrely satisfied. Cheers! I'm starting to sober up here. Oh my god. And you know what? <laughs> oh god! <laughs> I grabbed my beer so quick, I was like, no, my beer! Look at the seasoning on this chip. And this cheese is gonna be a little firmer, a little more to deal with. That's too much crunch. Negative three, give that a seven. It's like a layer of toppings. I would have liked the toppings spread out you know a little what? bit. You know what? I like your, I agree with you. Because yeah. look, it's like chip. Blank chip. You just spilled a chip on the Blank table. Blank chip. It looked Blank. great. Not, not bad I give that, I give that bad boy a 10. Yeah. When you're drunk, you need that sloppiness. This is just... You know, it's very dry. You know, all in all, not the worst nachos, but let's uh, let's get a total on this, Steve. Our final score is, wow, you guys are so <laughs> intent on this. 154. If you could not eat the nachos here at Big Wang's, where would you go? I would go to uh, El Compadre's on Sunset right here. There's a bean at the bottom of my beer. <laughs> Uncle oh, Collins had a little too much of grandma's cough medicine, so <laughs> our intern has to drive us now. Don't crash my car. Okay. I'm pretty confident these nachos are gonna be the best nachos we've had today mm -hmm. because we're at like a real Mexican joint. Granted, nachos yeah. aren't a traditional Mexican food, but I do think these will be the most <laughs> what in the world is going on right here. Oh. All right, so this is how nachos need to look. Look at Ryan's face. I gotta make sure it's good. Jesus, man. What do we say, Steven? This is ridiculous. All right, that, that, is, a, that is a hot 10 right there. Hot yeah. 10. The block is so fresh. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So fresh. Oh my God. So they grew in the backyard two days ago. I would choose this over sex any day. Absolutely. I still like sex, but I think these are good nachos. <laughs> it's just like, it's a perfect mix of like the stretchy and gooey. And can we all agree this it's 10? Nine, just because I want to be annoyed. Oh my annoying. God, and Steve. Just because I want to be annoyed. This is why no one likes you. <laughs> the reason why we're all giving this 10s is not because we're drunk, because these nachos are amazing. They're so, so good. good. Drunk factor. I don't know much about drinking, but 
Gotta give this like a three. It's too, fancy. it's too fancy of a restaurant to like. Oh my God, Steve. <laughs> be going ham at drinks. We're drinking flaming margaritas. You're gonna ruin their score. Be three. a team player, God damn it. Three. Oh, oh my God. God. Yeah. Your final score is 189. I'm full of nachos and margaritas and beer, and uh, Quasi, don't be too heavy on the gas on the way home. Hey, big wing. Hey, double wing. Hey, big wing. Full way, five wing. Hey, I mean, I know I'm a little gross. Make your milk in my mouth like butter on toast. Hey.